Today on our 2019 Subaru Forester, you're going to be taking a look at, I'm going to show you how to install the Curt T-Connector Vehicle Wiring Harness with 4-Pole Flat Trailer Connector. The wiring is going to give us all the proper lighting functions to safely tow a trailer. Both turn signals are brake lights and our running lights. We're going to have 3 amps per circuit for our stop and turn signals and 6 amps per circuit for our tail lights. And it's going to be compatible with 5, 6, and 7-pole adapters. Another nice thing about this wiring is it's going to have a converter box. And what that converter box does, it protects the factory wiring on the vehicle from any backfeed if the trailer wiring has an issue. It's also going to come with a nice dust cover. It's going to help protect your connections from any dirt and debris. As far as the installation on this wiring, it's very simple. It's going to plug directly into a factory wiring that's located in the back of the vehicle. First thing we need to do is we need to remove all of our floor coverings in the back of the vehicle. Take out the center foam piece. Then we're going to take out the foam piece on our driver's side. Use a trim panel tool. It makes this a little bit easier. Uh, if you have a large screwdriver, it will work also. And we'll just pop these fasteners out. Pull this out and set this side. Next, we need to locate the uh, taillight wiring harness. In the instructions, it's going to tell you it's behind this panel. In the 19, they actually moved it, and it's right down here underneath, so we're not going to have to remove anything. So we'll pull this out. We'll take our wiring harness, connect them together. We're going to find a place to ground our wire. Um, your kit's going to come with a self tapping screw. I would suggest. If you go here, it's going to go outside. This piece here is actually doubled up. So if we go through this, most likely that this panel here runs underneath of it. Uh, as long as we're on metal and not on any plastic, we'll be okay. We're going to take our wiring harness once we get all that. We can install our fuse. And then we need to secure our converter box. Now your kit's going to come with some two-sided tape. Um, it's completely up to you on the tape. Um, Sometimes that tape will come off, it'll come loose, and then you'll have this kind of wobbling around back here. What I like to do is try to take this and secure it to some existing wiring on the vehicle. Uh, you're less likely to break your zip ties uh, than that tape coming loose. So this piece here is probably a good piece that we can zip tie that to. Now we're going to test out our wiring using part number I26. Left turn, right turn, brake lights, running lights. Now that we know our wiring is working correctly, I brought my four pole over here to the center. I'm going to reinstall my foam piece here on this, my driver's side. finish off with our floor coverings. And when we're ready to use it, you simply pull it out. You're going to lay it over top this rubber seam, stay away from any of the connection points. And we'll have plenty to hook up to our trailer wiring. When you're done using it, you simply roll it up. Store it in our compartment, out of the way. That'll do it for a look at an installation on the Curt T-Connector Vehicle Wiring Harness 4-Pole Flat Trailer Connector on our 2019 Subaru Forester.